DirectPix.com presents the HP 14 Chromebook Battery Replacement. Be sure to subscribe to our channel by clicking the icon in the bottom right corner and leave any comments, suggestions in the comment section below. Please read the following warning before attempting this repair. You're doing this repair at your own risk. You're now going to take the HP Chromebook and flip it over to remove the screws. Using a Phillips screwdriver, remove the 11 screws. The ones that are marked in orange, you'll need to lift up and remove the three rubber feet before removing those Phillips screws. Here's an example showing you how to remove one of the rubber feet using some tweezers. There is three of them all, two on each side and one in the middle. You can see the one in the middle on the left side of the screen. Use the Phillips screwdriver to remove the Phillips screws from underneath the rubber feet. With all the screws removed, turn the Chromebook back over. Open it up. Using a case over and a tool, and we're going to speed this up a little bit, you're going to run it around the edges, which will release all the latches, the little plastic latches. Keep working around it until they're all loose. Once all the tabs are loose, you will now be able to start lifting, but do not pull the keyboard all the way up as there is cables attached. You're now going to remove the touchpad cable from the, from the motherboard by lifting up the white tab and pulling the cable straight out. Be gentle as you don't want to rip the cable. Now you're going to disconnect the keyboard cable from the motherboard. Again, this time you lift up the little black plastic and pull the ribbon cable straight out. Be careful not to rip it. You're now able to remove the palm rest assembly from the rest of the unit. Now with the palm rest removed, you'll have easier access to slide the cable out for the battery cable that's connected to the motherboard. You're now going to remove the four screws that are holding the battery in place. The ribbon going across the battery is held with double-sided tape. You'll need to lift that up and get it out of the way in order to remove the battery. You are now able to lift the battery up and out. For reassembly, take the new battery, slide it back in, and seat it in place. Now reattach the four screws that were holding the battery in place. Now finalize the screws, then we're going to reconnect the battery cable back to the motherboard by pushing it in. Grab the top half assembly and we're going to now reconnect the ribbon cables back up. You're now going to reconnect the keyboard cable to the motherboard by sliding it in and clamping the black plastic tab back down to keep it in place. You're going to do the same thing with the touch pad cable. Slide it in and take the little plastic tab and push it down to keep it in place. Now you're going to reseat the top case by snapping in all the tabs again. Now with the tabs all reconnected, you're going to flip the Chromebook back over and reinstall all the screws. Be sure to reinstall the orange screws that have the feet and put the feet back in.
Again, don't forget to put the rubber feet back in. Your Chromebook is now all fixed and has a new battery. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to subscribe to our channel and be sure to check out some of our other videos.